I could have just made Zeitgeist Addendum like other socially conscious filmmakers do, in the sense that I could have just said, oh, well, here's a bunch of stuff, here's a bunch of problems, hey, here's some possible solutions, take what you will with it, and uh, just roll with it and see what happens. Uh, I really was on the fence about putting, at the very end, join the movement, www.thezeitgeistmovement.com. And six, join the movement. Go to thezeitgeistmovement.com and help us create the largest mass movement for social change the world has ever seen. I knew that the moment that it became something more than just a film phenomenon that my life would likely change dramatically, which it has. Zeitgeist Addendum was sparked out of people emailing me saying, well, what do we do about all of these cultural problems? What do we do about a corrupt banking system? What do we do about people that are locked into establishment social programs, if you will? I consider the trains of thought and mind to be a program. I consider society itself to be a program that's running. Uh, and the programming locks people into a specific frame of reference. Um, how do we deal with these issues? How do we do? What do we do? And uh, Zeitgeist Addendum was an attempt at answering that question. After Zeitgeist 1 was released, um, it got into the hands of Jacques and Roxanne. And after reading Jacques' book, which they sent me, I realized that this was really important information. I realized that even I was backwards on a lot of issues that uh, needed to be corrected. And in order to get society in line, we have to think about the fundamental problems. This was something that I was attempting to do in part. I had a notion of, but it wasn't until I met Jacques Fresco that the lens became focused. It was like all these things that I sort of had an inkling of. Jacques' experience, life experience, what he had talked about for song, just focused me in the right direction as far as I'm concerned. So I made a whole section with him in Zeitgeist Addendum, and uh, that's how it took off.